Hey, it's Ella. I'm back again with another video in our Ultimaker series. In this video, we're going to be talking about the feeder lever. So in case your prints aren't working properly or coming out and they're spaghetti or you're seeing some uh, missed spots in your prints. Sometimes your feeder can be clogged up with some microfilament, microplastics. So what we want to do is clean it out. And this is what I'm going to show you how to do, or you need to um, re-lube your gears inside of there. To fix your feeder, or check your feeder, you're going to need the universal screwdriver that's provided and a little bit of the grease that is provided in your accessory box. First and foremost, machine is off. Uh, next, we're going to open up that feeder lever and take out all your filament. So you take out all your filament and spool it back onto your spool. And then you're gonna take your Bowden tube out. So this is your Bowden tube. You're gonna take that little clip out. Try not to lose that little guy. You're gonna push down on this little coupling and your Bowden tube should be able to pop right out. Next, you're gonna unscrew these two screws. These two screws are what keeps your feeder attached to your Ultimaker. So we can take this right off and we can take this whole feeder and hold it in our hands and make it easier to work on. And another thing that we can check on this while we're holding it is the feeder tension. That's one thing that can mess up your prints as well is this little tension. This guy right here, he has to be right in the middle and it is controlled by a screw that is on the inside of this feeder. And that's very important that it gets placed back on the inside of this feeder because it is, um, the tension is with um, a screw on the inside there. And here is one of the gears for the feeder. Here's another gear and you can see a little bit of green stuff. That's the grease on there. So that's telling me we don't need to grease anything because a little goes a long way. And what, what, what else we're gonna do is we're gonna open it up. When you open it up, you're gonna hear that, you're gonna hear that tension spring pop. So you take off all four screws and you use the screwdriver that is provided in your kit, in your accessory box, this little guy. There's your feeder tension, it just popped, that screw just popped out of the feeder. Here's that screw right there. And we're gonna open up the feeder. There's two couplings in here for the Bowden tubes. There's the plastic coupling that goes on top, and then there's the metal coupling that goes on bottom here. And in here, in here is where your filament goes and gets fed through here. So you have to make sure that it's clean there. And sometimes you just need to blow out your microfilaments to get that clean. So you just want to make sure this area is all clean of microfilaments and not too much grease in this area because that is actually where your filament gets fed through to make a print. And since that's all cleaned out now, now we need to put it back together and you have to make sure you put pieces in the right spot. So here's your coupling for your Bowden tube on the bottom. Here's your coupling for your Bowden tube on the top. And here's your cover, but we have to make sure we have this tension screw on the inside of this cover. So when we put that on, we have to be very careful and we're gonna have to push that with our screwdriver, we're gonna have to push that into place. So what I do is I put it down so I can get some leverage and I push that screw into place. And 
and then close it down. Once you get that first screw in, it should be easier to get the others in and locked into place. And once you get everything locked into place, you want to make sure your feeder tension is in the proper place. So that screw that we just put inside on top here, we have to make sure it is locked into place and we want to make sure that it is right in the in the middle of that feeder tension. That'll let us know here's the feeder tension and that'll let us know that the filament is prop properly getting fed at the right at the right amount of tension. We just screw it or unscrew it to make sure it lines up to those little notches on the side of your feeder. Once you got all that done, then you can close it and you can put it back on. You screw it back on and you put everything back into place. And then you can load your material and you should be able to be ready to print. So when you put the Bowden tube back in, you want to lift up the coupling a little bit so you so it goes all the way in. You want that Bowden tube to go all the way down. And then you put that Bowden tube clip on that coupling so it doesn't go anywhere. You want to open up that feeder. We just cleaned out all that feeder and now your filament goes right in there very smoothly because we cleaned it all out nicely. And that's how you fix your feeder. Chinan for watching our videos. Please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel.